I'm here at BYD stand with Elliot from Fully Charged. How are you, mate? I'm good. This is a wonderful event. It's so good. Yeah, absolutely. So happy to be here. I'm so happy you are here. <laughs> Thank you. Mate, you know, so just thinking, to me, China is the market to be watching right now. That's and right. You live and work there. Yep. You're seeing the transformation. Yeah. What, what, what's your impression of, like, what do people think about the two vehicles there? Uh, there's been a huge shift in the last kind of uh, one to two years. So there's a lot of people who are very skeptical about electric cars, including my father-in-law. He said, no, don't buy an electric car. It's going to go wrong and break down in three years. Mm -hmm. And definitely don't buy a Ch Chinese one. Uh, he's eating his words now because we now got two electric vehicles at home. Yeah. But everyone's shifted. You know, the penetration rate in most cities is uh, about 20%. In wow. some cities, it's even more. Uh, and you've got a full electrified transportation fleet. You've got buses, taxis, you know. And some of these taxis, uh, they're like MG taxis, yeah. done about 250,000 kilometers in just and a couple of years. They didn't replace the battery? No, what? no, it didn't blow up either. Oh, <laughs> it's amazing, right? It's amazing. Um, so it's a huge shift and there's so many EVs on the market now. There's, there's almost too many. Yeah. And I get offers almost every day. Oh, we got this new EV coming out. I'm like, I don't have enough time. <laughs> I can't re <laughs> review everything. So yeah. uh, there's been a, a massive shift in you know, government policy and the policies in cities. Mm -hmm. You get free number plates, you know, charging infrastructure is very easy. There's a lot of it. Um, obviously, Tesla's had a huge impact, uh, and the factory's there, so yeah. they've been dropping the prices recently mm -hmm. uh, to make it even more attractive. And there's a bit of a price war going on now. Is there just? Um, well, that's good. Massive discounts, like 50% discounts on some cars. Wow, uh, like by other car makers, not by Tesla. Yeah, right? not, no, not Tesla. Yeah, yeah, Tesla yeah, dropped Tesla. it by uh, four or five thousand dollars, I think. Okay. That's, for the Model that, Three. That's, that's pretty substantial. Yeah. And then everyone's now dropping their prices. Okay. So it's going to be a very bloody year, I think. <laughs> Well Interesting said. times. Love that. So, I've watched your reviews like on the BYDs, yeah. you know, the Atto and the Seal and another Dolphin. One. Dolphin, thank yeah. you. Out of all those, what do you think is going to be the game changer? Oh gosh. For me, uh, I mean, I think the Atto is incredible, mm -hmm. the one behind us here. Yeah. Because this is the one they're pushing into the overseas markets. Mm -hmm. You know, they're going to, they've been in Thailand, I think they've already sold about 10,000 units. Yeah. And yesterday they just announced they're building their factory in Thailand. Wow. That'll be ready in about three weeks, probably. <laughs> exactly. No, I think it'll probably take about a year. Beat that Tesla. <laughs> well, theirs was pretty quick as well in yeah. Shanghai. It was uh, nine yeah. months, yeah? Yeah. yeah. Um, I think the Dolphin is actually more significant. Okay. Uh, it's a smaller car. It's going to be a cheaper price point. Yeah. It's very practical. It's just a really good all-round car. Mm -hmm. Very much like the MG on the other side of the camera. Yeah. Everyone loves that car. Everyone will love the Dolphin. Mm -hmm. And then I think the Seal is just such a big step up for BYD. It's got the handling, it's got the dynamics. It feels better than a Tesla Model 3. Okay. Um, the, the design is great. It's the first real, I, say, I suppose, global car for BYD. And it's an unfortunate name, Seal, but yeah, yeah. it looks fantastic. And it's really popular already in China. So, And in China, all of the waiting lists are about six months. Wow. And they're selling about 100,000 a month. Yeah. Exactly. It's just mad. Yeah, that's it. And you know, yesterday I had a, a talk with uh, Jack and you know three other yeah. YouTubers, and um, you know we were talking about can Tesla be beat? And in my mind, well, they already are. You've got the likes of Toyota who sell nine million vehicles a year. Yeah. You've got BYD nipping on the heels of Tesla. Yeah. Yeah. So it's only just a matter of time. So. I think it's already too late. Yeah. Yeah. I think you know. BYD are selling, I, I remember last, late, late 2022, yeah. every week it's like, BYD is going to Israel, BYD is going to Egypt, BYD is going here. Yeah. You know, they were just constantly, constantly selling overseas and no one else has done that. Yeah. And they're filling a gap where Toyota isn't. Yeah, that's it. All the Chinese, oh, excuse me, all the Japanese car makers. Yeah. Uh, yeah. They'll be missing the boat. They'll be missing <laughs> the boat. They really will. Completely. Absolutely. Well, look, I really appreciate you coming on and having a talk with me today. And look forward to seeing you in the next Fully Charged Live. Yeah, definitely. I'll be there in the UK in a few weeks' time. So oh looking forward gosh. to it. Brilliant. Well, thanks for coming on. Appreciate it. Thank and you very much. Enjoy this comment, subscribe, and I'll see you soon.